I don't know about you, but seeing all of these these posts this morning um, sure bring back a lot of memories. Um, I know I did a video yesterday a little bit about this, but I felt like I just wanted to explain maybe just a little bit more. Um, you know, going back, gosh, it's hard to believe it's been 18 years. Uh, I see the pictures of and the videos that people are posting and um, man, it brings back a lot of memories. Um, most of them aren't pleasant. Um, you know, just seeing those pictures, seeing the videos of people that, you know, were trapped up on those upper floors and um, just jumping because they didn't want to, they, they, they knew their, their time was up. Um, just seeing all of the pictures of, you know, the, uh, the police and the firemen going through the, the, the rubble in the following days and weeks and just the utter destruction that that caused um, just brings all of those kind of memories back. You know, um, I, I've mentioned before, the reason I, I, I created that, that program to, to give back to people is because in small, little, tiny way, I just, I just want to say thank you to those people. Um, I, I tagged Jeff Film and, and Brian Lysing on this video only because I've had a conversation with both of them. Um, actually, Chief Film brought it to my attention and, and actually mailed it to me. Um, uh, Stowe is, is looking to, to put a memorial together. And as it stands now, you know, the policemen are, are, are honored uh, when they pass. And, you know, they, they have a, a service for them and uh, to honor their service. And, uh, you know, oftentimes, like when, when Chief Durker passed, you know, he was up in his ears here. He was up in his years. And so the people that he served with, so many um, weren't able to attend either because of health or because they weren't with us anymore. And so, you know, this memorial, one of the great things that he mentioned to me that they plan to do is when a, when a firefighter or a um, police officer retire, that they're going to have a service uh, to, to, to honor them when they retire. And that way, the guys that they served with can be there and, and, and respect and honor them, their family, just all of those people. And I thought, that's just such a, a great idea. And, 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 you know, I'm going to post in the, in the comment section and you know, I know they're looking to raise money for it. Uh, obviously, it costs money to build it, costs money to maintain it. That's that's what it's for. And, you know, it, this isn't a plea for, for your money. That's not why I'm doing this. It was mainly just to kind of bring awareness to uh, to this. And I think it's a it, it's a great idea. And it's just one more way that, you know, we can all um, pay our respects, um, honor uh, those people that that are giving back to our community in, in, in that way. And it takes a special person, you know, and just like just like veterans, um, you know, their families serve alongside of them. You know, every day that they they go to to work, just like with somebody that's in the military, there's a chance that they don't come back through that door. You know, there were almost 3000 people that last night. 18 years ago, didn't think anything different, and they didn't they didn't get get to come home, and they didn't get to go to bed uh, today. And so, you know, that event, and maybe it was because of my age, maybe because it was because of where I was in my journey, um, it really impacted me. Um, Desert Storm was another one. I had a good friend that that served um, Tony, and um, I wish I would have served alongside of him, but I didn't. Um, but the same, I, I just feel the same way about 9-11 that looking back, um, it was just such a horrific event. And uh, I, I know everybody's posting and everybody uh, went through it. Um, you know, we're all remembering that time. And, you know, I just, I just thought I'd get on here and just share. <laughs> I know a lot of people are today and, you know, I got, uh, um, I got an email this morning and gosh, I wish somebody had not set uh, their email program to, to auto send, you know, it's just a reminder that each and every day we should, we should be thinking about how we conduct ourselves, what we do. So, you know, if you see a, 
a police officer, you see a fireman today. Remember back um, on uh, September 12th when a policeman would walk into a, a coffee shop or a fireman would and, and people would, would cheer and they would clap and they would honor them. They wouldn't ridicule them. They wouldn't, they wouldn't, uh, it just was a different time. I'd love to see that come back, you know, where, where those people are, 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 are held in a, in a high esteem. And um, I guess that's just my thought for today. So, like I said, I'll, I'll, I'll put that information in the comments. It's not why I did this. I just wanted to bring awareness to the, you know, to this memorial that they're putting in and just hope that you reflect today, just like, just like I am, just like so many are. Um, never forget, never again.